Hey, what is going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to get the straight jacket along with the prison collar inside Fallout 76, essentially a prisoner or straight jacket outfit. So with that said, let's go ahead and get straight into this guide. Now, where you're going to want to come on your map to get this is a place called Eastern Regional Penitentiary. When you get here, it will look a little something like this. Now, all you guys have to do is, now I'm going to jump in my power armor. You don't have to use your power armor, but there will be a lot of super mutants here. So just keep that in mind. These super mutants are extremely, extremely difficult to take out. They are going to be uh, like hard to kill. Um, I came here level 35 uh, and uh, they were beating me pretty bad, but luckily I found some power armor here and uh, I'll kind of point you in the direction of that as well. So to get this outfit, what you're going to want to do is just kind of follow the path I take here, kind of along the left-hand side. You'll come to kind of this opening in a wall, uh, this blowing hole, and you guys are going to want to head through that door there. But for those of you who want to know where the power armor is, it's actually fairly simple. If you guys look at this blue shack right there, and you guys look at those yellow things, those are power armor stands, and that's where the power armor spawns, or at least that's where the power armor spawned for me. Now, what you guys are going to want to do is just uh, come back on this way and uh, go through this door. Now, inside this place will be Scorched, so keep that in mind. They're not high level. They're, in fact, very easy to kill. However, there is lots of them, and in numbers, they are pretty tough individuals. So once you guys get in here, it'll look a little something like this. Ignore that. I put that there. Uh, what you guys are going to want to do is come over here and pick this lock. Once you pick this lock, you will get a penitentiary key. So make sure you guys go ahead and pick that up because if you explore this place by yourself, it's going to help you a lot. Now, what you're going to want to do is hack this security terminal. Um, I believe it's one or zero. Fairly easy to hack. And all you guys would have to do is go into cell block controls and open cell doors. Now, I've already done that for sake of guide, but once you guys open the cell doors, these cells will kind of be open. And if you look in here, you will see your straight jacket. If you come on over this way into this uh, next room, you will see kind of these prison collars, and that kind of completes the outfit. However, if it's not there for you, you guys could always go this way. And there's also a cap stash inside the sink, so make sure you guys uh, grab that. Um, once you guys uh, do that, come on uh, to this place that says cell block C. Go into a right into this room. Uh, also, keep an eye out because a fusion core does spawn here. Come on over this way. On this table right here is where I found my straight jacket. Uh, here's another one right here. And also, this is where I found my prison collar. But if you guys don't find the prison collar there, what you can do is just follow the path I take here. Come into this room right here. And if you guys kneel down by the skeleton, you, you can see, if I could get it to happen again, that it says Prisoner Collar. And all you guys have to take is the Prisoner Collar. And uh, that's how you guys get the Prisoner Collar and the straight jacket inside Fallout 76. Kind of a little outfit. So I hope you guys did enjoy this guide. If you did, please be sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe as it really does help the channel grow. I produce Fallout 76 guides of all kinds. Power armor location guides, fusion core location guides, armor guides, weapon guides, any guide that you could think of for Fallout 76. I will be producing uh, either in the future at some point or have already produced on my channel. So if you guys could drop that like, comment, and subscribe to show your support, that would be amazing and I would truly appreciate it. Anyways, I love all of you. I hope to see you guys right back here in the next video. But until then, remember to stay freaky and bye-bye everybody. Thanks for watching. See you next time.